never not a dose! Let's draft a little nice little hunter. Plus, we got the Robin Hood hunter, right? And we're gonna jump right in. I didn't have no F, guys. I didn't have no F. Everything was fine. Maybe your end? Maybe Twitch end? My internet seems fine. My stream seems fine. Alright, so we've got Mark Cho v Jungle Jams right here. And honestly, I've been feeling some Jungle Jams. And I'm feeling bananas, so... Let's do it. Jungle Jams. Bait and switch. Gotta, gotta, gotta cause those master secret guys. Just a little master bait and switch. Little wound prey. Sure, why not? I like the weapon. I'll be honest with you. I like the jungle jams, Andreas. Especially nowadays that you have those uh, specific spells, the bananas and the monke, Andreas. They really, really do help. Hey, <laughs> Autumn. Good to see you. I think a little mystery winner. Solid early game menu with a nice uh, discover. Not a big fan of these. We'll take a Cobra. It's acceptable. Make it two or take a Librarian. Make it two or take a Librarian. Now, I like the Cobra, but I think I want one Librarian simply because it's tradable. Helps me hit the cards I want to hit. Oh, nine lives. Nine lives ain't gonna be good. What, what Death Realm minions are there gonna be? Like high main. Hi, we're back. Um, yeah, I lost connection to Twitch. That was weird. All right, let's see. So we do need some twos in here. I do like me a piercing shot, but I also need to make sure I'm getting some twos. And Parade Lead, I think, is a good one in Hunter. A lot of little rush stuff. I'll go ahead and take it. These all kind of suck, but we'll take a Bola shot. Okay, I love both of these a lot. Doesn't really look like a Fable Stable Hand deck, so I'll take a Star Power to help me stick. Oh my god. How likely is it that we get Forge, guys? How like we got the right? We got the right? We got the right? So likely is it? Hundred percent. You have to believe in it. Okay, Charles, let's do it. I've got Golden Ignis, man. Do I even want more jungle jams? Sure, why not? Little Eye of Chaos. Why not? Let's have some fun with it. Party animal. Sure, let's do it. Piercing Sniffer. You know what? Sniffer with the parade leader, let's do it. Arrowsmith. Sure. Breeder. I don't really have good beasts, but I don't really like these two. We'll take a Breeder. Macaw? Sure. Bait. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, of course. Titan Forge Traps, Merklins. Uh. But, I mean, these are great cards, but I think because of Ignis, I have to take the Crusher. A little invento medic, because the other cards suck. Yo! Yo! I'm not even sure what to take here. We have enough ones. Maybe another uh, baited switch. You guys know I'm a master at this, right? You guys know I'm a master at this. <laughs> I, I, I know, TV. I, I, uh, it was kind of close. I love Observer of Myths, and I think Observer of Myths is an amazing card, but it doesn't feel like an Observer of Myths deck, because I have a lot of one attack minion breeder, lacking twos, even lacking threes in general. So uh, Myths into no three. Right, like... I love myths, but I don't think it's a myths deck. So I think I might take a bait and switch. Then again, myths is really freaking good, dude. Like, really good. Ah, uh, take him for a short walk, Matty. 
meet in the middle, right? And then sleep with Dugo. I love Makor, but I have quite a few ones already, Danny. And a Makor already. Uh, if I didn't really have ones, I would pick up the Makor. Uh, Quality-wise, Myths is the best card for sure. Just I'm not sure if it fits this deck. Uh, so I think I'm going to take a bait and switch. Take a Coil Car Pack Runner. Good too. There's a solid three. There's a great four as well, though. Let's go ahead and uh, take the great four. There's a great... Oh. So Tremors is just too good. Let's do it. Give plus one attack to all minions your deck hand on battlefield. Ah, eh, we'll go Aerosmith. One tame beast over breeder. It doesn't feel like a breeder deck. Alright. Maybe I should have taken myths now because I did end up with the Awakening Tremors. Awakening Tremors is such an amazing activator for myths. Nah, you gotta play it on two. Dan. If, if, if it's your only play on two, you play it on two for sure. The thing is, I feel like you need to be able to work it in, right? So you play it on two and then you play something on three that buffs up the rest of your minions. Awakening Tremors would have immediately made me take, take it because... Awakening Tremors makes it so easy to activate because you can play all three and you'll get all the buffs. They'll all become a five and it will become two. They'll become six, it will become three and then seven and that will become four. It's just so insane. But looking at my deck, I had sure a few two attack minions, but beyond that, really nothing much, right? One attack. Barely any minions here. Weapon. Ignis I'm holding back. Almost no three drops. This deck is uh, a little awkward for sure. But we do have Ignis and one forge. So I'm hopeful. But the deck doesn't really feel very cohesive. So we'll see. We'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. I believe. I be I believe. I believe, man. I believe too. Why not? Why not? You asked for it. Rather the civilized, give to the wild. Alright, we're chucking all of these. By the way, to anyone that doesn't know, guys, this card right here, Sniffer. Okay? If anyone asks you what this card is called, Sniffer. That's the name of the game, guys. This this card, Sniffer. Okay, to anyone that hasn't been here in a while. This one's Sniffer. You've got the Sniffer Man and the Sniffer Beasts. Sniffer. Nah, thank you, Orange. Hey, it looks exactly like that. No, not Licka, Sniffer. Not Licka, Sniffer. Hello. Greetings. Greetings. Hello, hello, greetings. Oh, no, we've already met a friend here, guys. Hello, Devil. Good to see you. I have been chosen by Amatis herself. That has to die. Lick us the fuck here with that uh, Fila. You forgot Fila, Orange. I guess we go with a breeder. Honestly, just take a cobra or a hellhound. I don't think this is a party animal kind of hand. Although I could. Shimmer party animal get the buff on the work, but work on four is then mech because I want to jungle gems. Let us let us go ahead and take the cobra for turn six, and I shall pre-hit. Why not? I slept like crap, Matty. Barely slept, but I'm slowly getting back on track. My parents left this morning. So some more time to catch up with stuff. Dropping by to update my prime sub. Don't mind me. Tom. I'll mind you. In fact, heck I'll say thank you even. Thank you, Tom. Have a lovely day, you're dropping off, man. If you're lurking, enjoy. Take care of yourself. But yeah, I'm, I'm a little bit relieved, what can I say, Maddie? Um, I've got a lot of work to do over the next week to get back into like a, a normal routine, I call it. We'll see. Gonna be busy. Uh, I need I need to catch up on sleep, that's for sure.
You lovely lad. You lovely lad, you. I'm gonna start drawing with the Metro here. Thank you so much. For the uh, 10 gifted subs, Orange. Big welcome to everyone there getting hit by Orange. Yeah, making use of the September. Uh, thank you so much, man. I really appreciate it. Thank you. To anyone that isn't aware, until the end of October, there is September active on gifted subs now. 25% uh, off, I think. Uh, but Twitch does cover the reduction in costs. As in, I, I get the same as if you didn't have a discount. Yeah, yeah, until the end of September. Um, think what I said. Maybe I just said it differently a little bit. Um, thank you, Orange. Loads, man. So we could play a two and a three. I do really want to just kill this, though. I do really just want to kill this, though. Just jungle jam it. They're, they're going to full clear my board, but... Maybe I just jungle jam. Otherwise, they're taking this trade. I could play a two and then pray to hit deadly shot. My other option is crusher, but if I pick up crusher, I have to forge it. Oh, I thought I said start of October. Yeah, 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 end of September. I think I said start of October. But yeah, yeah, end of September it is for sure. Thank you. Yeah, I, I don't think I can risk this 50-50, so we'll just go with the gems here and keep Smarky Dark in. And see what it's worth. Thank you again, Orange. By the way, I haven't, uh, I haven't, I saw your post. I, I saw the No Muncher post, Orange. Um, I saw it a little bit before, before I started stream. So I haven't really, uh, I haven't really, like, proper posted or whatever but I'll, I'll take a proper look and uh I'll, I'll post it yeah that sucks orange it's uh it's a crappy one it's a crappy feeling you know it's a crappy feeling um uh, they did fix the judge unworthy one by the way orange They did fix that one, which is which is nice, which is nice, you know. All right, let's go ahead and play the Cobra. I kind of want to start uh, start drawing a little with Metronome. Okay, I, I can't draw. I gotta forge this because I have Ignis. I just have to forge this, which probably means we're gonna do the swingy swing, which means we'll do a little bit of this. See what we get. Why not? Let's go ahead and upgrade our jungle jams. And go face. See what we get. Just a nice little uh, Valdemir right there, Valdi's boy. Um, uh, I, I reported it that one almost immediately. I think it was low priority though, because nobody had ever seen that interaction orange. Um, but they did record it, and uh, was surprised to see it come out with a with a fix. Ladobris. Ladobris. Could have gone for a more draw, but eh. It's gonna take it slow here. Coming in with the five gifted, my man. Thank you so much, hey. I, uh. I saw you all talking about Hearthstone, uh. I don't know, being scared that Hearthstone might not be... Continuing in the future because of the layoffs and stuff, and uh... I saw you, you, you said something like, I I'll follow Dose, and you made me smile, man. I, I appreciate the support. Through... Many different forms. Thank you, hey. Um, and yeah, to anyone that isn't aware, there there have been some layoffs, specifically in the Hearthstone team for Blizzard. I don't know the real reason and whatnot. I'm currently assuming it has to do with a little... Uh, assuming, this is my opinion, I do not know the truth. It has to do with a little bit of a, a restructuring in the wake of the Microsoft purchase. Uh, but we don't know. Right now, all I will say is that hearts out to... Uh, 
all the people affected by it. These are real people getting affected by real uh, serious things. Your heart's out to them right now. And uh, hopefully we'll get some more news over the next few weeks as to what this means for Heart still and take it from there. Uh, 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. We're almost there. I could even rip like a freaking star power or something here. We'll also go for more draw. Let's go ahead and do this. A little bit of this. Get the draw. There's Ignis. I could just Ignis. I could Ignis next turn into turn 10 and hero power here. Which is also fine. A little bit of this. A little bit of this. A little bit of this, 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 this and this. Missed one damage, it's all good. Who else we got here? Portrick Star, good to see you. Kayeni, hello. This is gonna be the next big React stream, I'm sure. Hello, Ilana. Hope you're good. I thought I was going to get more investment with Microsoft. The truth is, I don't know, Danny, but I don't know why what's happening is happening or whatever. Um, but restretching will happen for sure, right, Danny? Like, for example, if they have existing team hierarchy, they will need to shuffle teams and utilize existing middle management, right? Which means they might have to shuffle some middle managers and maybe even bring people in from their side. So they would have, for example, their own internal quality and legal, which means some of the designers that work on the face of quality might sort of need to be either moved laterally or offered a severance package. That's why I'm expecting it to be this way, because someone told me uh, just a few days ago that the Microsoft purchase went through, and all of a sudden we got this news. Um, uh, Alexa versus Lunara. So, uh, that, that, that's, that was my, that, this is my assumption. The truth is I don't know, though. The truth is I don't know. We'll keep the jungle gems and the macaw here. Ah, uh, so we'll see. We'll see. I did not study accounting and finance, no. I studied engineering, but I... Engineering is a very vast subject. I also studied and worked in project management, resourcing, financing, team leads, man uh, low-level management, cross-functional teams. I will go in Macaw for now. Um, like, for example, where I used to work. Mm, it depends how they're acquiring it, right, Dano? Yeah, except for central functions. So, for example, once where I used to work, um, they had a small acquisition of a newer company, but they shuffled that company into the existing company and restructured teams. So, some of the engineers were promoted and shifted laterally, but they were all offered the severance package, and some of them just took the severance package straight up. And we don't know, maybe that's what they were offered, right? Maybe that's what they were offered. Uh, maybe, no, maybe Hearthstone's going to maintenance mode and they were all fired. I don't know. Hearts out to all the people affected for now, and we'll take it from there. Anonymous, I don't know who you are, but thank you so much for the gift to Lobo Fanina. Really appreciate it. Really appreciate it. Really appreciate it, Anonymous. Morning, Viking. Hello. Yeah, that's why I said like this. Yeah. You understand more than me as well because you have like specific insight, right, Dano? But all, all I want is to not jump to conclusions. That's all. Um, that's all. That is all. That is a. I could coin four. Let's go ahead and coin jungle jam, stay the hit, and keep smoking. Uh, thank you all for the support with the hype train. And obviously, TV, you too, for the earlier support. TV with the resub and the 10 gifted. Tom with the resub. Orange with the 10 gifted as well. K with the 5 gifted. And Anonymous with the gifted. Thank you. Enjoy your little. <laughs> We're gonna get the perfect team to raise a real to hide to the magimal, I believe. 
I, uh, I, I don't know. My, my assumption is that they were offered a severance package. Some people took it. Because even if you look at the people that were laid off, you have a couple of people that were in the one year range. Like one person that was in the two year range. You have someone that's been there for 18 and a half years. And, uh, Sounds to me like he took a severance package because maybe he doesn't agree fully about a shift or something like that, you know what I mean? I don't think you let go of someone like that in that way. Yeah, or no, I was actually thinking about it. I should have awakening then swung then played these. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa. <laughs> I love you guys. Um... We'll see. If I get any more information, I will share. Probably in Discord mainly, but I I I'll share. Yeah, but... It doesn't matter, right? I guess I should have swung first. Okay, sure. They're really trying to cut down on damage here, I guess. We could eye a Chaos, we could also 4. I think we just eye for now and smart. Doomsayer would have mattered. That's true as well. Oh, it would have... Oh, yeah, that's true, Alana. It would have been less, uh, less than I did. We could try for a sniffer. They're just always going for the kill. I could tame beast this, but that's even worse versus the four ones. 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18. We're actually kind of almost there. I I'm just gonna go ahead and do this. Just type in again the hero powers. Try and end the game. One off? One off? Three off. Direwolf Alpha really brings me large dose of nostalgia though. Metin too, no idea. Man, Druid has a rough, no AoE. Yeah. That's why I try to capitalize on it, Mathy. That's why Druid uh, needs to be ahead. Oh, three off. Yeah, no worries. Okay. I mean, that's annoying, but I think we should still get there, right? One there, one there, one there, uh, three, four, five. We played Khaled. That we're getting event quests, we're getting quests, quests. We rolling another one. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, I like how both of you are a different version of an an and another one joke. Oh, anomalies! I forgot about these. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, anomalies are down to 25%, so here's a few updates. Anomalies are down to 25% of games. They still in, but they're 25% of games. I'm full Malin. One pray is good on one, but going first, I prefer a different one. Um, uh, well, there's new uh, portraits in the shop for gold, if anyone's interested. Um, uh, other things too. Those is live, what else do I have to say? Oh yeah, there's a new event in the game, which has a nice Inzoth portrait for Warlock at the top end. Uh, so I highly suggest you start working on that. It's got about 13 days left, I think. Sure. Uh, we can Breeder Parade Leader. We'll see here.
Yeah, you wouldn't want to miss this portrait. Okay, yeah, uh, happy. You happy about what you're doing? Are you happy with this? Uh, are you happy? Dude, I think I freaking doggy biscuit this. I don't know, Parade Leader is also quite good, but... Man, I don't know. I like keeping the spells for the jungle jams, but... I make... I think we should do this. Doggy this. <laughs> you think they want a Plague Strike? Well, whatever I do, they get a good Plague Strike, but I guess this gives them a worse Plague Strike. Unbelievable. Oh, unbelievable. Dude, you're here. Why did you just rope me? <gasps> air fryer things. Mm. Did you end up trying the new thing in the air fryer? That's fine. Heart strike. Okay. Acceptable. Oh, last week you said you were going to try something new. I, I think. I think. Oh, now. What you doing? What you making? We got Doggy Biscuit back. That's just coincidence, by the way. Um, I could play Ticketmaster. But, man, I don't know if it's worth. Me too, Orange. I thought it was just returning to my hand. You know what? Screw it. We'll do it. This does the same thing, but I can double two next turn. Sonat is here. Alright, so uh, from 2-0 to 12 votes Sonat, right? It's on you now. Take it from here. I'm just gonna sit back. Just like this. It's all on you now, Sonat. That's it. I've got a coffee. Cheers, guys. Um, uh, from now on, it's all Sonat, guys. The Citadel stands strong! I'm not even trying to explain. Okay. Just, just tell me how good it is later. How about that? Wow, they don't even go for the kill, huh? So how about we just jungle jam the 3-2 and start smoking then? Can I have subliminal? I have push beyond? A 12-0 priest yesterday? Six hours! Oh my god, Push Beyond. Do you still have a job? Do you still have a girlfriend? <laughs> hey, congrats so much on the 12-0, man. 12-0 is insane always. A 12-win priest. When priest is sub 40% insane. 12-0 priest. My man. Congratulations, dude. More than Sabi, man. Three hours after work and three hours after she fell asleep. <laughs> uh, phenomenal, man. Phenomenal. Dude, I wish I had one more mana, huh? I wanna... I, I have to forge this because of Ignis. I just have to. So let's see. I could call Carpack Runner, Doggy Biscuit this, make it a 6-6 six, six and trade here. Don't really need to. I could Tame Beast with the Parade Leader. Bonk face. That seems fine, actually. And just keep going, face. I won't swing yet here. I could rush this. Actually, is that worth it? No, I let them kill the ticket master. It's all good. It's alright. I can understand. Oh, they look like Arancini. I mean, the first thing I thought of was something entirely different. I'm not going to say that out loud. Hey, so I saw the Jack Chart from Matrix Replay, but I don't have the pick overlay. Yeah, yeah, so 
the deck tracker is this one that I use right here. This right here is the Hearthstone deck tracker from HS Replay. My, uh, the, the one that I have on the draft is the one from GitHub from Super Trio, the one called Arena Tracker, Paulin. I actually use both. The Arena Tracker for the draft overlay, and then the other one for here. Uh, let's see, five, four, three. This should always be a clear, so I think I just rip it, honestly. I'll hold one more. Oxinia. Feta con masa de batata. La coxinia es tradicionalmente rechida con carne de frango cocida y desviada podiendo ser buscado. Y también se recheda con requiao cremoso. Tal cual o catupiri yundo frau. Ok. Looks good. <laughs> I'm, try I'm trying here, ok? I'm trying here. Um, ok, let's go ahead and uh, rush this. Play a little bait and switch. Bonk. I could get a 4. I could wait and try and get a, a six, though. I'll wait one. I'm reading. Uh, I'm. 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 In one horrible way, I'm reading Portuguese. <laughs> I. I kind of understood, though. It's made with like a potato ball. It said, and then with shredded chicken and something creamy. And I assume made into a ball because I can see the shape in the picture. <laughs> there he is also. I can also swap into an English version. But eh. <laughs> uh, I can breathe her into Hellhound. That's probably what I'm looking for here. I can also rush this. Do I want to rush it? Maybe get the kill here. I want to get this improved or whatever you say. Man. Let's go ahead and get the trade. Forge drop to get frenzy value. But I could have, but... Then I also have to swing here. Like, it works as well. It works as well, right? But um, I I would have rather got the the sweet big kill here and represent larger damage. And uh, trading could also pull tickets. So yeah, I like the trade. So you resemble the face on the ticket master cards and get shuffled in, mate. You should try Portuguese dessert called Bolo de Bolaja, or biscuit cake made with coffee. That actually sounds good. Bola shot. Or if I call car pack runner, Bola shot. I don't want a sniffer as well. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's see how they deal with this. A little bit of this. I want to build this up to at least six now. We get the one kill here, and we'll play step up. I, I know I could rush this or this, whatever, but I I, I want to keep the spell now. I want to keep the spell. I'm looking for what? I don't know. Ig oh no! Kalagos and Death Knight, dude! No, no, Kalagos and Death Knight. Okay, that's actually not too bad, but how am I gonna kill Kalagos, guys? Every time I am kicked in this freaking game, every time. I don't know whether to play the call car pack runner. I feel like you have, actually, Lana. Keep I'm 
day. I guess I'm just going face and pretending... Like they have no way of unsaving. It's not too bad. Let's try this. Okay, I mean I've got a deadly shot. I've got Ignis. I've got three freaking tickets as well, right? So come on. Right, I mean, come on. I've got... I don't have star power no more. Okay, they're going for the trade. Yeah, I'm keeping back the shifter. I think I need a, a better high roll than uh, than Cold Car Pack Runner. I know I could have Cold Card and had like an extra two or three, but it's not winning me the game here versus this stuff, right? Freaking Calagos. Is Calagos what they got from Shifter Zeris, by the way? No, from Promo Drake. Okay, we still got the bait and switch. So that's something. Okay, nice little extra damage there. But they can't they can't kill it now. They can't kill anything actually now, which is great. Sure. Hmm. Do I ever just fully hold? Man, I'm tempted to fully hold. Do I? Do I drop them down? To four? Does set up lethal, right? I've got four ones with three tickets, so four out of 16, 25% chance to draw one. I think I'm holding. Or am I playing everything? I'm playing everything. Because I get one more minion they do than they actually have. Just interesting, right? Because... See, if you pick up a one, keeping metronome probably guarantees you lethal. Which is something. I have some other outs and I actually don't even need to draw an out is why I'm playing it all. Have they full clear? I have lethal. Mixed day. Uh oh. Uh, that has to be bait and switch. I don't care. Right, mixtape is uh, from, uh, from my... Discover a copy of a card your opponent played this game. Okay, so that has to be bait and switch, which is fine. Now this is a random hunter secret though, okay. Okay. Oh no. Ah, there's, there's still Mucho Bueno probably, yum yum. Yum yum and the tum tum. Yeah, for next time, yeah? So I sh if they don't have a way of killing this one one, I should win. Oh my god, they have a way. So now I lose to Wandering Monster. Right, I actually lose to uh, to Wandering Monster now, right? Can you believe that? And bait and switch, so I take all the damage. Can you believe that? Can you believe that? I, mean, I thought it could attack for a second. No! What? No! What? No! I didn't! I did not! I did not play that! Every 
every time I am kicked in this freaking game. Every time. I did not play that. I thought I could attack with it, so I clicked it when it was on board. But I didn't touch it again afterwards. Hmm, lame is that. I did click it because I thought I could attack with it. But I thought you had to redrag it out, right? I didn't know clicking it on board brings it back. Yeah, basically I only need one damage because I couldn't fit in the hero power. I thought I thought you had to click and drag back out. Yeah, I, I tried to attack with it, basically. I tried to attack with it. Um, this was literally decided to be a loss by a higher entity. Yeah, the them getting the random wonder. It had to literally be. Yeah, I just all I did is click it, Kyony. So apparently it does. I did click it though because I I tried to attack with it basically. Yeah, was there any other two cost spell which saves them there? I mean, heal that has to hit face would have saved them, I guess, but nothing else, right? Not even explosive, no rogue secrets, no other hunter secrets either, right? Redonkulous. All right, let me grab something. Let's go for three. Ruined orb face to my face? Wouldn't have saved them, right? I'm talking about their two cost spell. For me, I could have had lethal if I actually cast the two and the three cost face uh, spells, right? I just needed one damage to their face, so but there were a lot of a lot of ways I could get lethal. If I didn't play the three drop, I would have been able to play a three cost spell and the hero power as well. Um, but hey ho. All right, BRB, let's go. Oh, two mana, one for monkey taunt. That would have been a good one for them, actually, as well, Sharknado. I would have been able to live another turn, uh, depending on their top deck, though, because I wouldn't have swung in because I knew they had bait and switch. Like, I knew that if they got a wandering monster, um, uh, that I would trigger a bait and switch there, but I had to risk it, because what are the odds that it's a random wandering monster, right? Uh, whereas if it was the Monka, I would have hero power passed. And then hero powered again. But they could still, still have top deck lethal for sure. I think the card... I, I tried to attack with the card, right? So I clicked it, basically. Tiny. Whilst... It, before even the animation of it br be, being brought back to hand. Right? So before... It had the green outline. Before the animation of being brought back to hand. And I... I clicked and tried to attack like a, a small click and drag and like uh, the one gifted a tier one sub to air a girl 48 this is their first gift sub in the channel like a little attack motion you know what I mean Andreas give the one to arrow girl as well thank you so much Andreas how many on the freaking first gifted sub? Legend. Legend. Hey, thank you. Really. Appreciate it so much. Lead man. Hello to you. Go a little bonk here, a little bonk here, a little face there. Um, but Shiny is right. The, the monkey spell would have 
potentially won them the game as well. So would have uh, Mark of the Wild, I think. Hmm, intriguing here. Really wish I had a freaking... Man, you just don't star power this, right? You just don't. I think I trade the Librarian and see if I can find the cheap spell. I mean, I could silence it. How about I just silence it instead? Alright, let's do that. Trying to play Board Swarm and Druid with not much reload and faced a Golganeth at 2-0 and 2-1. But you said you were a good luck charm, son. Oh. Wow, they just pee on me, guys. They just pee on me, guys. That's not good. For me, but I just lost. Because my opponent uh, high rolled a random two cost from a top deck Chaos Tendril. What you talking about, man? My opponent just generated a random Hagatha scheme from Peon and it was perfectly 4 damage on turn 5. What you talking about, man? What you, what, what you talking about, man? What you, what you talking about, man? <laughs> uh, I actually can't corrupt the Pearl Tusk. I don't know if this is worth it. I think I just do this anyway. And smart. I don't think I even want to make this trade. But maybe this is warranted. We'll do it something like this. The reason is that they are not able to pop the sniffer easily they need something extra which they can just have and it's fine somebody else has a bad luck charm here then yeah me sana my life screams bad luck the hell is this guy and lightning storm no you no you're a lovely charm what you talking about Bait and switch. Kill this, ignore the 4 4. Could Pearl Tusk it, but I think this is fine. Like, they want to trade. I could Pearl Tusk, but I think hero powering is actually just more important, to be quite frank. And they, they need to do they, they seem to not have a lightning storm, right? I think they would have cast it over this last turn. Let the pain speak to me. Okay, never mind. Um, Pearly, Bonky, Wounds Prey, Hero Powery. Let's go. We got this. We're going three. Okay, my opponent, he hurts. They hurt, I should say. Like the car rental company. But with a U. Just dodge the Gorgonaut 2 1. How about make it so that if they have Gorgonauts or not, you win anyway? Because you good. Okay. Oh no, they perp blame me. Oh no, Sana. Sana! Come on! <laughs> um... But you lose if they had Golgan out there? Nah. Freezing trap for a rush life. See, I could have done that actually. I could have done that. I've played the one. The thing is, with star power in hand, 
They're basically stalling, and remember, I've got a lot more damage in the deck as well. I could have done nothing. Um, but Shaman has other ways of healing as well, right? Witches brew and altered cord their own totem, blah blah blah. Like the only punish is them having specifically what the 3-3 three, three rush that is in lifesteal form, I think. Or or something like Golganet, but then Golganet doesn't matter if I had a minion. Um playing the one also puts a secret, which makes them uh, have to play around it. I wanted Catrick though, I'll be honest. That's what I wanted. Honorable Sudoku. Oh, there's Fountain. Yeah, there is Zillia. Zillia X is a rarity though, right? But I actually forgot about Fountain. I actually forgot about Fountain. Fountain maybe, may, maybe means I should have thought about a couple of other things. Oh, fountain. I forgot about Fountain. Oh, that's that's kind of a rare card, but I I forgot about it. Medic! Yeah, they have to also finale, and then what if it's bait and switch? It would be worse for them, right? Create some Aquardio. At least it doesn't hurt anymore. I wish you got Jerry. I think I might honestly coin the Kolkar. I kind of like it because... Yeah, I know that I lose the coin into the 1-1 one, one rush, but if they play a 2-3 here, I get the um, the ability to value trade and, and play or whatever. And now I can Tremors and play a 4-1. Yeah, nice little 1-1 one, one extra as well and do a little bit of this. Had a really good control warrior with Odin as a win con, like in standard. It only lost to lose to a black rock and roll from Kipster into two... 12 16 walking fountains. Wow, that is holy moly, dude. Wow. That's rough, dude. So I'm actually gonna play the 4 1. I'm feeling a fire sale with that cultist play. And we're going Metro into your mother's here. Metro, your mother. Um, and we'll see. Okay. Now they can ping, unfortunately. So I just kind of debated myself. But I also get a little bit of a read that they don't have a fire sale. They would have fire sailed anyway with this, but still. I think now we just go for a boop, deep up, deep face, deep face. And next turn we can play a two and a three. Or just the Eye of Chaos. Uh, actually, I have issues with the three here again, because I need to forge Crusher, right? You're kidding me, mate. Correct read? Yeah, it was. It was a correct read. Hey, Rafa! Yeah, I could have played the two. I could go two, two, one there, for example. Won't forge that. Jungle jams. Okay. Almost clean. I think I want to go with the forge here. The one draw. Well, I would have only drawn Deadly Shot, right, Orange? I don't want to play Crush here for sure. Um, Because I need it for Ignis. So I was a little bit stumped simply because it's just Deadly. Uh, as in, I could have played a two, but then I'm not playing Deadly and I'm not playing Crush here. So I would have just drawn Deadly, basically. Do this. Of course it's a ping. Uh, we can rip the jungle jams and we'll see. See spells. I have, still have quite a few spells in the deck. 
We haven't played Ignis yet, right? Oh, Ignis. Ignis, Ignis would be nice, you know? Ignis would be a nice draw. We've got Makos, Shimmerfly a beast. Shimmerfly's a beast as well. Cobra. Okay. Ray of Frost, sure. I'd look for a Hellhound. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Mm, not enough. Let's see if we can pick up the Hellhound and take it from there. No Hellhound, so uh, probably looking for the Macaw anyway. We'll play Macaw and probably just jungle jam face here. Not what I was looking for. I'm gonna put the pressure. Iron Tame Beast does get the kill, right? Aerosmith Tame Beast. I kind of really want the, the jams out though. Oh yeah, we'll star power here. Probably also Aerosmith instead of hero power. Not sure about this swing. I think I hold back one. I think three class beasts are fine. You typically want to go to about six, but we're too far from six, right? Rune orb face? Don't tell me they're gonna rune orb another fire sail here. I mean, even if they do, these tendrils should end the game, right? Blizzard, sure. I have a nice shuffle, right? Get three, four Raptor in. Go for the Ray of Thrust, sure. So I expected something like an AoE, right? It's what they needed. Alright, sure. I mean, it seems you need another lesson, mortal, Jerry. Jerry reminds me of Rick and Morty. Do you guys know, by the way, a new season of Rick and Morty is coming out soon-ish? I'm looking forward to it. But I'll probably wait until most of it comes out, which is in a million years. Can you please kill their minion? Can you please kill their minion? Please. Can you please kill their minion? Can you please kill their minion? I mean, it did in the end, I guess. This one going face is pretty good. Come on. Come <laughs> on, one. <laughs> Didn't even hit the right one. Yeah, order, loop, guys. What if it killed it instead? Freaking hell, guys. kill this I think now I'm swinging though well, that sucks I uh, simply so if they play a taunt I can hero power them uh, all right what next it right, looks looks like we have this what are the odds, dude? Eggplant! 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 Just... Eggplant! 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 Pew. I don't... I don't... E eggplant! You win this one. Thank you, Jerry. Yo, 23 points? I'm getting a lot of points. I thought you used to only get, like, two points. Or something from those. Okay. Sure, a dinkum. No problemo. So far, we only lost to a complete and utter unbelievable scamsies.
You need, you need to you, you need to stop coin flipping, push beyond. Is this you, Matty? <laughs> You are not over 75. There's no way push beyond. I don't. I don't. Licks with the support and the fun fact. I've been subbing long enough for a giraffe to go from inception to birth. Is that the gestation period? Is that what you call it? 14 months? Interesting. I'll hold. Uh, thank you so much for the 14, Lix. Appreciate it so much. Thank you for the prime. Thank you. I didn't know. Fun fact about giraffes there. You're a giraffe. <laughs> you're, you're a giraffe. Damn girl. I think we want to get the kill here. I think opponent's name translates to Mother of Smokes. Oh, is that like the uh, Central European version of my dad went out to buy cigarettes? <laughs> I don't even. I don't even know how push. I never bothered learning. That is annoying because I can't get the jungle jam kill. What I could do is equip jungle jammer and rip the star power next turn. Maybe I need to remove this Gamba stuff. <laughs> yeah, they're going for the corpse. Doesn't compare to your sure. What? What? You what? Proof. Right here, guys. Proof. He what? So let's see. Five, four, three, two, one. Always a clear. Actually, worst outcome, technically. Double freeze. Wow, that's pretty good for him no problem <laughs> look at that guy I mean, give a thousand have you ever given imagine a loan shark giving money out to a gambler right and the gambler finally wins a bunch of money and just comes back and gives you all his money <laughs> not, not even just what you what what he borrowed all of it <laughs> um, I think I want to just go ahead and summon the two and play these two. Oh, hey, Lori! Good to see you. Does the plague improve the weapon? Does it not? You have to be one cast, the one casting the spell, Arctic. So same thing with the uh, tendrils from Eye of Chaos, the chaotic tendrils. Uh, there's a difference between a spell being cast and you casting a spell slash playing it. For Jungle Jammer, you have to be the one casting the spells. Okay, now I need my Forge card. Yeah, it's the same for Yogg and all, all of those cards. Uh, even like Parrot and stuff like that. There's a difference between you casting it and stuff. Artix lost 96k. I remember the wall had climbed to like freaking 2 million and lost it all. The loss will be mourned. Okay, so they went for the the game here, huh? Sharp note. I think I'm actually doing it this way. I wanna keep this. So I go face, then I take this straight. It makes them think I have a bunch of spells.
<laughs> Orange netted five hundred. Oh my god, you have a lot, Kayani. <laughs> See, Kayane's the... Kayane's the... That's the hard-working man, okay? He doesn't gamble, he saves up over time, slowly but surely, you know what I mean? Finally, my ancestors are useful. There we go! There we go, we'll do it next turn. So for this turn, we're going with a little bit of this. No use pre-hitting, I think, but I'll do it just in case. Right, so the idea, and uh, maybe this should be on the far left because of Hollow Hound, actually. Um, the idea is that they're gonna bonk bonk hero power, and then we trade the five four star pushing dome, but we get the Ignis next turn. Um, we have the bait though as well, so maybe they don't want to trade. We know they're double unholy one blood, so I do expect things like death strike, but. They, they kind of need to be trading here, which is where bait and switch comes in. Dude, I am not going to spend time doing a custom custom investment scheme for, for caffeine. Uh, I think there were other options. Give me a sec, though. I'll, ch I'll check that, that much for you. I'll check that much for you. I'll check that much for you. Mm, crap. I mean, you can give and donate and stuff for sure. Okay. Stream elements modules. There's dueling. Yeah, I can sub things like raffles, but eh. I just get a ten. Wind fury or life steal? Kind of scared of dying, but we'll go wind fury. Do I ever take armor instead? Nah. We're fine, right? I'll take the safety trade though, because this thing will win me the game. There we go. 21, damn, okay. So apparently you get a lot more points for events. Because I was worried, right? I saw that they uh, they increased the, the the amount of points you need in the event to get the portrait is 4,500. Um, uh, and usually you get like, what, three to seven points? But I'm getting like 20 points per game. So honestly, it seems like it's easier to get from playing now, so... Do I keep Ignis? Would you keep Ignis? I only have one Forge card. It wins game solo. It does, but... It's a win call only if I hit the Crusher, right? Otherwise, it's just a dead card. But yeah, let's give it a go. I'll keep these two. I can coin parade into bait. Yeah, I have more importantly, I have the important piece of the puzzle. Basically, is is the thinking. Yeah, if I get Crusher and no Ignis though, Crusher isn't a dead card, right? It's weird. This is the important piece of the puzzle. But it's the piece of the puzzle that's a dead card without the other one. <laughs> it's, uh, this interesting... Uh, both are the same important. 
It's okay, we're gonna get crash here, don't you worry, guys. It's, uh, sometimes there's just this level of skill where you just know. I drew it, I swear I thought I drew it. Uh, I think I might just trade and hero power. I mean, I could deadly. Man, maybe I deadly. <laughs> Have you ever done a two-piece puzzle, Big Baguette? Both cards are equally important for the activation of Ignis, I guess, technically, yeah. Solid, but couldn't solve it. Yeah, it makes for it makes it makes it toughen, makes it toughen for sure. Soloist would suck for me here. I have the Cobra, I guess, as an answer. Why do you fall? <laughs> up you have a ping? How badly do I want to kill the Stereo Totem now is the question. Oh my god. Um... How badly do I want to kill it? Not at the cost of an 11 damage, right? Not at the cost of 11 damage, right? Oh! Oh, I should, I should have shot... Oh, I could have... Oh my god, I could have killed it. Okay. For some reason, I really thought it was, uh, I really thought it was plus one. Well, talk about Pepega. Hey, Biggie Man! When I was young, but yet I used to have, uh, 10 and 12 piece puzzles. I remember those. <laughs> I remember, I actually remember them. I want to hear about, like, every turn now. Skeropar should just win me this game, right? I do have one Forge card, Lychee. You are still young. I was younger than Matty. Hey, you're younger than me, Matty, aren't you? I'm here facing the SC Superstar. Oh, did they get... Uh -huh. You win this time. Kept Ignis and won the game, told ya. Huh? Yeah? The, 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 this is the question though, did I win because I am a uh, top level skilled player like no other? <clears throat> or because I kept Ignis? Yeah, you're a young one, Matty. I'm in my 30s. Keep tremors? Keep jammies? Not even sure about keeping jammies. I think I am fine keeping. <laughs> oh my hey. Yeah, I haven't I haven't been performing so well, man. Ooh. Okay. Remember asking my dad to buy me a little chocolate Nestle chocolate tablet every Saturday morning because they came with a small Lion King puzzle inside? Aww. When I was young, you know I remember Lana. There were these little rectangular chocolates. They had like animals and stuff on them. And they there was just like a little rectangular milk chocolate and on the back they always had a sticker of like an animal or something. And uh we used to just randomly chuck them there. But I remember once my grandma found the official book where you put in all the stickers, I used to collect them. But they were freaking borderline impossible to collect, I feel.
Let's do this. We'll probably go jungle jams into shimmer bait or something like that. Get the little rush. They're probably going to ping and play a 1-2 here. Oh, yeah, yeah, hey. I'm just telling you because you're looking for it. I, I, don't, I don't really care too much anymore. I don't think I'm going to swing. I think I'll just take this trade. Oh. And we'll see, my hand's a touch awkward, but bait shimmer hero power is what it's looking like next turn. That's a swing for sure. Hellhound. No, I think I'd rather do this. Bait shimmer hero power swing face. So next turn I can maybe hellhound bait again. We'll see. Or just Hellhound Hero Power, for example. I might have to hold this back a little while longer, try and hit some uh, some more spells. Ah. Never mind. Feel that healing beat. I'll take that. Always nice to debate people. Oh. Arrow Smith instead. Maybe that's better, actually. I want a full smart, but I don't know. What about arrow, bait and switch, trade the 3-2? Or trade all the 1s? I could just hellhound. I think I want to do this. 1, 2, 3? And I don't know how to trade now. Man, this card, the Shimmer Fly, it's been, uh, it's been suspicious. It's been suspicious. Baby, I'm a firework. Ooh, wildfire is annoying. I want a hero power, but parade leaders. Pretty good. I know it forces this ping, but it's okay. Um, I just wanted that two three out. Is it, it? It seems like they don't have AOE right now. I'm trading away this card. I need I need better cards. Okay. Smart, smart. What you gonna do now? Get baited? I mean, I I am a master player of bait and switch, right? Hey, FN. How's the new better treating you? Like the other one? Crap in general. But yeah, you know what? Having some fun playing. Hey, I, I'm. Not, hey, guys, guys. Hey, don't don't judge people. Don't project what you do onto other people. Okay, that's what I say. To everyone watching this on YouTube, everyone's calling me a master baiter, but I, I'm a master player of bait and switch, which is a different thing. The kind of conversations we have on Twitch. Alright, let's go for eight. See what we have. Party animal jungle jams. Okay. Ooh. Tempted to keep these. Let's do that. With a nice little coin. Ooh, got the wound prey as well. Okay, 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 okay. That's dose in the spotlight. Oh, Bemonic's loving this, huh? Bemonic's Bimonic, loving this, huh? Okay. 
piece of puzzle one? I'll take hidden memeing. We can hidden meme next turn. Play some Darkest Dungeon 2. You know, I've heard the... Uh, I, I've never played Darkest Dungeon. I watched Sofa play a little bit of Darkest Dungeon 1. Uh, a while back. A while back. Uh, but I heard Darkest Dungeon 2 wasn't well received. It's Dadu. Subliminal. Darkest Dungeon. Dadu. It's like a pet name, you know? Um, I'm not even sure what we're gonna do here. I might honestly coin Jungle Jams. Let's see what we get. Acceptable. I heard it's just too different. Gotcha. Yeah, I think I have to... I don't have to, but I wanna coin the Jungle Jams, I think. Ah, uh, this is a great dragon though. Draw is super nice. Let's me let's me maybe find my Ignis a little more consistently. Lake Strike is pretty good for them. Probably just go ahead and play Proto. I mean party animal ain't getting worse if I play Proto, so let's just do it. Over a hundred hours of Darkest Dungeon 2, and I sure can recommend it. Looks all right. Not really, uh, not really. Yeah, it is a little bit of a roguelite, but it's a little bit different. The pace of it is different to what I'm usually used to, I guess. Um, I, I try not to really think about other games too much because I don't know I, I don't want to intrigue myself or whatever with them if I'm, I'm not going to be playing them. You know what I mean? That was an insta pick right there, which is kind of scary. Kind of scary. I need to play the serpent and the shimmer. The party animal gets worse, but I think it's worth it. I have Ignis. No, I need Ignis. 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 The first one you could grind during several runs, then to then just lose your heroes. Another rune door, but in stopping the rune door again. I'm gonna hold the weapon one back. I know I could just go ahead and summon a one cost. Equip the weapon again next turn, but we're still a little bit far off, and I have some options with spells next turn. Oh, void scripture. One of them's this. Kebab Knight. Okay, let's summon a nice little board here. I swung because I'm going to re-equip another jungle gem, so I'll split them up now. Uh, Ignis is active now, so that's something to know, right? Pretty nice hit for them there, though, for sure. Don't do it again. I mean, annoying, but... Acceptable. Please, 
do that. I was going to crush her doggy biscuit, but we'll, we'll try that. Yeah, the worst is no muncher, chogal, and hollow hounds kebab night. They're just... It's a clear, and it's the generation of something that forces your opponent to deal with it, but also... <laughs> heals them. Or clears your board, because it has rush, right? Essentially. Tremors. I got a test for explosive. I was just trying to see if it's worth everything, but because of the freeze, I think I go for everything here. Great beast. Yeah, not bad, not bad. And concedes. I had lethal from hand with quick shot, right, as well. Alrighty! Get mage! Eight wins! MVP? The pilot. My only loss so far was kind of a scam, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. Like, a uh, scam from their end, getting lucky, and a scam because I felt like I didn't really play that three, but so be it. This trace looked confident like he was gonna clear. Uh, no, the Kraken was never clear, though, right? I did, I just bought them, Alexander. Hello, 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 I just did. I like how the last, even the Jaraxxus-Stein one from last week, which is still there, by the way, I like how they're adding five packs to them. Nice little plus. Um, I lost through a very lucky top deck, uh, top deck Eye of Chaos into a lucky Tendril, basically. Alright, let's go for nine. Just gonna rush to the bathroom, but let's go for it. and keep the bait and switch is this is this the person uh, is this the person who freaking got lucky versus me it is the same opponent right? is this the one i lost to though it is this this is the person i lost to guys this is the person i lost to oh, hello hello that's a great drake though I want a Thorgne, I want a Coil Car, but they're heroes. I'm gonna start with Bait instead. Yeah, they only started adding the packs last week, Alexander. Uh, they also upped the cost of the default ones available in the collection, though. Don't try anything. Um, so instead of 1,000, they're 1,200, and instead of 1,500 for the ones with the. For the ones with the. Uh, 
cards back there, one eight now. I think I actually just deadly this. Things are a little awkward otherwise. I could call car, but then they'll just trade swing hero power and they'll still keep a three too. Just take some damage. Um, we can try some proto into Kolkar turns, right? Maybe pick up like a wound pair or an arrow smith to go for this. Oh yeah, yeah, they, they were like that till a week ago, Alexander. I've been paying 1.5k for a portrait on card back and 1k for a portrait up till last week. Last week was the first time they added five packs. Actually. Uh, starting from Jaraxxus Stein, and now they had the other two. Which is nice. I like it. It's a nice touch. Uh, the five packs makes it a, 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 lot, a lot nicer. Not that I really care about the packs, but, you know, it's just since I'm buying them anyway, it's, uh, it's a nice little plus. <laughs> uh, Ignis is great. Just give me that crusher. I, I can't lose twice to the same person, especially when the first loss involved them scamming me. we got to remember they've got Prison Breaker... Uh, they are Frost and Unholy and Blood. They're Rainbow, actually. Hard Strike. Damn, shit. This is the same person, yep. Who I lost to, yep. Uh, that's annoying. Um, I assume they might just eulogize me here, but we'll see. I didn't want to just play 1-2 and doggy it, so we'll see. If they eulogize the call card, so be it. Okay, I could hellhound that. The question is, do I doggy biscuit something else instead? Probably, let them kill this, it's fine. Ah, uh, that's true, actually, Apoctis, right? That's true, actually. I'll do this. I'll protect this. So we've got Thorignir Drake. Uh, best draw, a Crusher. 100%. The draw we're looking for is Crusher, right? Even Librarian for trade, maybe. We gotta... We I can't let them win again, man. There's their forge. So I assume they're gonna hero power this 2-1. Probably still Thorignir Drake, but I might trade the 1-1 off. It's losing one damage face to summon a 3-1, which I think is worth it. Thing is... Oh. I was gonna say, thing is, they're probably gonna have found a clear or something, but guess not. Ever Bola shot instead now. Man, it's just too good, right? Unbelievable! Alright, let's go ahead and do that. I can bowl a shot next turn. Alright, still, uh, I'm looking for reach, maybe jungle jams. Oh, they have a swarm guards, so that's what's coming in. They play Swarm Guard, at least I do get a clean target in here. Hipster, man. sure, hipster's fine. I think I actually just throw it in your face, right? That's a lot of damage. In fact, is that lethal? 6, 12, 16, lethal. I mean, there it is, but... Alright, one for one now, Happy. Let's go, Biggest Burger. We're going for double Ds here. Yeah, everyone like them double Ds. Yous know it. Dun, dun, dun. 
Uh, the quest experience anomaly is bugged, yes, Alexander. Uh, they're working on a fix. Hey, Baron. Three more? Let's go. I'll chuck all of these. Yeah, I caught it because someone tweeted it coincidentally. I wish I was a 10 and 0, man. I wish I was a 10 and 0, but it's alright. We got my cards, just better stats in a way. I might invento before parade just so I can get the. It's more likely parade lives for Hellhound. Ooh, more so with the sniffer. Sniffer parade leader is a nice combo. They might actually value trade that. Simply to protect Parade Leader. Yo, you know what I could do? I could value trade Bait and Switch Shiver into Sniffer and then play Parade Leader on 5. Let's do it. And then you summon them all as 3 ones and they all cry. You just s s freaking clear their board. Come on, hit the two on the two on my man. I will. If they attacked the two on, they would have probably just lost there. Yeah, it is. It is your father. Uh, but it's the only one that I've heard of, at least. Uh, what I do know to anyone is that the games are giving a lot more XP. At least, the games are giving a lot more XP, it seems. With that play, I almost don't want a Parade Leader, because I can't pop the Sniffer. But what am I doing? Just Hellhound? Just Hellhound, I guess. Really awkward hand here, not looking good for us. No Ignis, no Crush. Okay, but that means they can't kill this. If we get so much XP, they should nerf gold. Won't anyone think of the poor shareholders? Ah, uh, to vent XP. So, nothing to do with gold. Gotcha there, Perrin. Haha. <laughs> I think I explosive just to debate them. So we go parade leader, explosive hero power. It's likely they have AoE and I might cry if that happens, but I have to assume they don't have AoE. They would probably take it because of the scent find there. Man, maybe I just take this trade now, huh? Nah, I gotta, I gotta push, man. I gotta push. I think we gotta do this. I fight too. Now they're angry. They have lightning storm. My board's gone, so the secret might not trigger. And they might just be scared to like swing into a minion or something, or they will, and then they're like, oh no, it's something else. That's so good for me. Means they don't have Lightning Storm, I think. Feral is fine. Double Feral. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Full clear. Hero power is worth more damage than Kolkar. I did not receive an in-game survey. I've actually never received an in-game survey, hey? Alright, take me to 11. Can I get my first 12? Yeah, it did feel like a little bit of a cheat. First 12 ever, yes, Perrin. I've never, ever, ever gone 12. Hunter should not have star power. 
I think I win without star power, Mia. To, to be quite honest. And if anything, Mage shouldn't have star power right now, I would say. We'll do it. Eggplant. 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 You know, Arena Eggplant. players aren't spending Eggplant. as much money, so they don't survey them. I don't, I don't. Uh, not true. <laughs> it's just random. Uh, may maybe it, it, it does impact, I guess, if you have purchased stuff before, but whether you play Arena or not, it doesn't matter. Look at this entry animation, dude. Imagine the guy that suggested Peng Pingu gets an entry animation. That value. That's. <laughs> Yo, what? <laughs> Am I scared of this? I think I actually go for Shimmer Fly. Uh, the others don't really feel like they're helping me too much. I I think I got a small. I mean, I'm kind of scared because they could. Ah, okay, that's why they played it. I was so confused. I was so confused. I think I got a coin the four here. I I gotta kill this. I was like, are they making use of the spell damage? Because otherwise they would ping, right? Uh, Arid Stormer makes sense, though. Arid Stormer makes sense. I mean, unfortunately, this is probably going to stay there the whole game now. This this card is oddly annoying. Oh my god, another Synthesize. Don't have another Arid Stormer, dude. So I'm looking to maybe Mystery Winner, Secret Shimmer. Okay, maybe we get some Ignis up in the air. Yeah, because of like deadly. Yeah, I think we go bait and switch. Just too good, right? I'll take the kill. Uh, maybe, I, maybe I'll just have to like 50-50 at Super Trio though. Screw it, you know? Okay. They know it's like bait. course why wouldn't that happen i think i have to take seven i mean i could crush her that but i think i take the seven here i am a fan of so but i suck on these nuts here father nice try though Okay, at least I gained some armor here. Oh no. Yeah, they're just going face, huh? Okay, I need to buff this and gain armor, basically. So, let's see. If I buff this up to four... Right, I take four and I gain four armor. Maybe I have to take this trade. Cause they're gonna they're, they're gonna have ten damage. I feel. I'm just trying to play around Firelands. The thing is, I think I always lose. If they Firelands this, I'm still dead, right? These Tendrils, maybe? Yeah, still dead to Fireball anyway, for sure. Yeah, even like the Scar, I did. This needs to stay alive, like, forever somehow. They're so likely to get a spell here. They also have the Mana Reservoir, right? Like... The Arid Stormers were... Yeah, just GG. The Arid Stormers were so good. 
Man, Synthesize is such an OP card. It gives them 4-3 weapons, 2-5 rush wind furies, spell damage, face freezes, activations of remnant. So good. I've been getting GG though. Constantly today. And we move on. Did someone just join Discord, by the way? Uh, like 30 minutes ago? Did someone just join Discord? Are you serious? Your father, is that really you? I'm, I'm asking seriously because someone's asking for verification, but I'm not recognizing the name. Uh, and I don't want it to be one of those. Rexa versus Deathwing. I mean, I, I, I sort of recognize the name, just. You know what? Let's uh, double check. It's alright, we'll get it accepted right now. Ah, uh, Tremors Aerosmith's really good. We're against Ploof. Ploof, Le Ploof, Le Ploof. Can't join this guy and misbehave and get banned? Alright, then don't. Yeah, we get to we get to start fitting in earlier, I think, RJ, a little more smart. I might get these your mongers out now. See what they can do, how they can roll. I hate that streamer mode now shortens everyone's names. Man, am I tempted to bait and switch, but I think we just gotta do this. This against Warlock, yeah. You just, you just start hero powering from turn one, your father, and uh, that's it. One mega three cards probably synergize with each other, or synergize with spells. Yeah, this is such a good card, T-Bear. Uh, okay, so I'm expecting like bellowing or sanitize, which is not a good for me, but we'll do this. I'm gonna play the secret for now, because number one, it scares them from Catrick, and number two, if they want a bellowing this board, I don't want the 2 3 to die either. Hey, Slizzit! Jamming! There's the sanitize. Okay. Crappy, but we'll take it. I'll just go with the double two. That's another good card, too, right? Four mana gain, three armor, deal three one sided damage. How you doing today, Slizzard? Just jamming? Okay, that's fine. Probably just ignore that. Just jamming. Sweet to hear. I think I'm trading away the Librarian. I just need better cards. I got you verified, man. I'm just going face. I'm not even trading. So uh, feel free to take a look. 3 0 in 8 minutes. You destroying out here, are huh? you destroying out here? Let's go, hey. That means, right? Another 24 minutes, and I'll see you at 12 0. I'll take this. So what do they play? What do they play? Did they forge? Oh, they forged. Ah, uh, so probably like a bellowing then. Mm, bellowing no bueno. No worries. We just throw it out. Ten's pretty good. Alright, so what do I really need, man? I don't know, some reach, like a jungle jam. Maybe top deck crusher into Ignis is also pretty good. That's good for me. They can still bellowing. 
They go for here, that's great. Yeah, synth. I've I've drafted remnants, but not with the synth, so. Baited by the bait. So do I have lethal now? This is the end of all things. Ready? Eleven. Final bus for the twelve. The issue with bait and switch orange is that. When you put a lot of pressure on your opponent, like I am, right? They're left in a position where... If, yeah, even I've been baited, right? You're in a position where you need the swing from the weapon. You need to clear their minions. So you're either swinging face and getting jabated by Wonder and Monster by Explosive Trap and losing. Or you're doing nothing and probably losing. Or you're taking the risk and if it's bait and switch, you're losing. And sometimes you just have to take the risk, which is why it's so good. Because if you're not swinging, then what are you going to do? You're just going to sit there and ne never trade, and I win anyway, right? And I forced them to use their sanitize early, and that's that was the, the turning point, basically. I had also already played one bait and switch, so sometimes, although this shouldn't be what you do, but sometimes people think they already had a bait and switch. No way, it's another one, right? Despite it actually being more likely to be the same secret because it's the most common secret. Um, there's that sort of psychology that people think it can't be the same one again. I'm tempted to keep Sniffer, but I think Arrowsmith, the question is Jungle Jams, do I keep? I think I honestly, without coin, I have better things to find, but we'll keep the Smith. That is not a very good starting hand. Especially with Deadly. Got a trade. Another precise deduction from Dr. Dose. Yeah, you can call me Sherlock. Sherlock Holmes. It's a sniffer, this one. Sundore Scent Finder, sniffer. Lead man. Frenzy some 411 hyenas with rush. Someone forgot to tell the magey face prior about the fact that they were supposed to lose, yeah. They did forget, which is really unfortunate. Don't you have 7 TV, lead man? How badly do I need the value of a Macaw versus a Hellhound? I think we just go Hellhound. I was hoping to pick up like a um, a party animal, honestly, with a Naga and a Beast in hand, but... Do I even want to know? Top deck of Forge. <clears throat> okay. With this hand, it's not looking like 12. Nah, I keep, I keep falling short of 12. Keep falling short, man. Am I deadlying this deadly trade? I don't want to hellhound it. It doesn't feel right. I don't really want to bowl or shot it either. So maybe let's see what this does first. Yeah, I'm waiting on it. So I guess I'm deadlying. We have the Corrupted Cobra, at least. Man, my employer expected me to do work at my job, so I missed like four games. Well, here you are for the final bus. You should invite your, your employer to come come and watch. Or not. <laughs> okay, I if I don't draw well, I think this game might be over. My opponent's barely playing anything, and I'm already falling behind. I already feel like I'm out of value and not, I'm not really pushing stuff. Hey, LM. Sure, Burger. Coming with the Hydrate. I need to draw well. Crusher, Ignis. That kind of thing. 
Makai is solid. Let's see what we get from it. Not bad. Let's go ahead and do a little bit of this. Um, they like to have like a hellfire or fire sale, right? Shooting star? I'll take a shooting star. That's their magic trick card, so me likey. Seen a lot of this today. There's Ignis! Okay! Shimmerfly can give me Titan Forge traps, right? So I know I could tame beasts, but I think I just arm a Gadillo for now. Because I don't want to like just Cobra tame beast hero power and end up not even net pushing anything. And uh, now maybe I try a bowler shot of trades and stuff. Wish I had a taunt in hand. Yeah, I need forge now. Secret, okay. Jungle jams, okay. I think I still bowl a shot, mainly. Man, you think it's Oasis though? So if it's Oasis, I want to swing first. But if it's not Oasis, I, I, I wouldn't want to bowl a shot there. Let's just do it this way. I just feel it's Oasis. So now I can change my play instead. Double trade the ones off and just play Cobra. Come on, give me that forge. Come on, dude. Please. Pretty please. <laughs> Pretty please. Even with the forge, we might have a rough time with something like this. Wow, they're going for draw. Hello, Nemler. Uh oh. Uh, we thinking grand finale? I'm thinking grand finale here. I mean, just go face doesn't really get me there though, right? The question is whether I play this beast as well. I think it may be a yes. I'm gonna hold. Because they're gonna be forced out of um out of grand finale. They can't grand finale now, right? They can't grand finale. How about a top deck void scripture into Blizzard? Fire sale. Ooh! That's a good sign! Your own face. That's the best one if they have AoE. Babbling! Yeah, something like Star Power is what I was expecting. Blame? So they didn't get fire sale, so we're in a good spot now. Wag one roldy. Archivist. Okay. Okay, so they have two elements, so they're still going for grand finale. But they're out of key and we get the 12! Win hunter! Baby! With Ignis! Always there. Just look at it. Just look it out. Just look it out for us. Did we even ever play the Ignis weapon? I played Ignis once in the whole run, right? Did I even play the weapon though? Wow. Or did they just concede before I even played the weapon? They conceded, right? Not even, not even once. Bait and switch MVP. For sure, for I sure, for sure. I don't... 
That's why I love bait and switch, man. Yo, 12 win. Thank you so much, Buffalo, for the six month sub. Yes, sir. 12 wins. And a nice 12 win, Hunter, right there. We believe, we said, I said, I said, shall we start with a Hunter? We'll go with 12. Good stuff. Sucks that we had those little disconnects earlier on in the uh, in the run, but I'll probably still get this up on YouTube. I think, honestly, MVP was the bait and switch for sure. I lost to a Death Knight, which I think was a scam, and lost to a Mage, Danny. Um, just, just cool stuff. It just smarked early. And the bait and switch was just a cherry on the cake. Let's take a look at what rewards we have. I need to start building up my gold again after buying those portraits. And uh, I hope you all enjoyed it. My first wave of the meta. And in the form of a hunter, which isn't sort of the thing you expect the most. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed it. I always ask. You know, if you want to help me on this journey, I'll say it a different way. Like the video on YouTube, sub to my channel as well. It really helps. It's just one quick click, but it really means a ton.